everybody in Chris Allen. I guess when I got started, I was on American Idol. So, I mean, that's that's pretty much how, how I got started. Okay, but like before American Idol, what made you want to be a part of the music industry? Uh, I don't know. I mean, for me, it just, I, I mean, I grew up around music. I played music. Um, you know, I found out that, you know, I was, um, <laughs> I, I had some kind of talent in that. So I kind of always picked up the guitar and I sang and, and, uh, and that's how it started. Okay, awesome. And Idol was supposedly your last shot. So are you happy that you participated considering you won? Yeah, I mean, I would, I would think so. You know, because if I if I wouldn't have tried out, I wouldn't be talking to you right now. You know, and and uh, and doing what I do, so I'm really excited about it. Okay, awesome. And what made you try out for the show? It was actually kind of a fluke thing. My uh, my brother wanted to uh, wanted to try out, and so I kind of just went with him uh, just to see what would happen, and and uh, we both just ended up making it. So. It was a, uh, it was kind of just a fluke. Okay. And during the show, I mean, you had some pretty outstanding moments. One of them was Heartless. What caused you to sing that song, yeah. and how do you continue to, like, keep that alive, I guess? You know, uh, we could do kind of whatever song we wanted to do that week, and I, I thought that that song would be kind of a risk, uh, because it's, Obviously not a, you know, it's it's a you know it's a it's a rap R and B song, and so I uh, I thought I would you know take the risk, and I thought I needed to take a risk, you know, to go further in the competition, and and, uh, and I'm glad I did. Okay, awesome. And also, I know like I saw you perform um, on Sunday, and you sang the song. So touring wise, what are your like kind of touring plans right now? For an hour now, we've been out for a while. Um, I, we're actually doing a show with Keith Urban tonight. Um, we're we're kind of going out and doing a bunch of different stuff. We were out with the Bannock Ladies for a while. Uh, we're going to go back out with them and do a couple more shows for the rest of the summer. Uh, we're going to be out with Maroon 5 for a little bit, too. And, uh, and then some more Keith Urban stuff. Okay, awesome. And... Next album, when are your plans to start put working on that and putting that out? Um, I mean, I, I, I'm writing right now, but definitely not in a studio just because we're, we're really busy. But, uh, you know, hopefully after the summer, maybe we'll get a little time. Um, we may be busy in the fall on tour as well. So we will, we will see. Hopefully we just, you know, we can get some time somewhere around there and, and get back in the studio. Okay. And also kind of like with that, um, I saw on Twitter the other day that you were filming a music video. So which song is it for and what's kind of the premise for the video? Uh, the song is, is The Truth. It's the new single out right now. And the premise for the video is actually, it's a little, it's pretty abstract. It's uh, supposed to feel kind of like a dream. Um, probably more performance-based than... Uh, then actually has a storyline, but uh, it's shot really, really cool, and and I'm really excited to see what it's going to look like when it's all said and done with. Okay, and how do you pick which songs you use as your singles? I mean, is it just kind of whatever the label thinks is going to be best, or do you get to go and pick which song you like the most? I guess. You know, it's a it's a uh, it's a definite conversation between you know me, the label. Uh, management and uh, and it's just you know what we all feel like is going to be the best idea. And how do you get inspiration for your songs? I think it's everyday life, you know, uh, you know stuff that happens to all of us, stuff that happens to you know specifically me um, in my relationships with people. So it's just you know everyday life stuff. Okay, awesome, and. What social networks do you have, and how do you communicate with fans on them? I, I mean, I use Twitter, so that's that's the biggest one that I do. Um, I think I have a Facebook. I don't really use it though, um, so I, I just use Twitter, and I talk. To, I, I use it about maybe once or twice a day. So, you know, tell the fans what's up. Maybe just random stupid information. Mm -hmm.